Today's video is sponsored by Verizon. As a full-time content creator, I know how important it is to have a fast, reliable internet connection at home. Are you on the hunt for the fastest, most reliable connection? Why not check out Verizon's 5G home internet? 5G home internet is here and is expanded to more areas. Connect your phones, tablets, TVs, game consoles, and more to the ultra fast and reliable Verizon network with a simple plug and play setup. Plans start as low as $25 a month with no annual contracts, no equipment fees, and no data caps with a mobile qualifying plan. Now, if you sign up for Verizon 5G Home, you're gonna get the Disney bundle for six months. That's Disney Plus, Hulu, ESPN Plus, as well as Stream TV on Verizon. Or you can sign up for the Verizon 5G Home Plus, which gives you the Disney bundle for 12 months. That's Disney Plus, Hulu, ESPN Plus, also $300 off Stream TV soundbar, as well as Stream TV on Verizon. Check if Verizon 5G is available in your area by clicking the link in the description below. Oh yeah, here we go again. Club basketball, game one. It's been like what, two years? Yeah. It's been like two years. It's been a while. Last time, last time he was down here. Hi Dad, play basketball. Nice look. Let's go. There you go, Bryce. There you go, Bryce. Nice, finish that. Yes, yes! Oh, all right, we're back home. Uh, I don't know if I got it on video, maybe. Either way, Bryce crashed and burned towards the end there, it was the last play. He got tripped up, he fouled the, fouled the kid, and then the kid fell on him. I tried to like, I tried like flopping so I could get the charge, but like my feet weren't set, so like I fell to my side. Yeah. And I fell first, I landed on my hips, so that hurt. Then he fell and landed on me, which pushed me into the ground even more. Yeah. I my hip. Yeah, it was an early, it was an early fall. But uh, three points? Yeah, just just three? One three. One, three. And, I, and I missed it! I thought I was recording. I think it's because I was looking through the clips, and so I was in the play mode. So when you hit record, it switches from play mode to record mode. I had to hit record again, and so I missed it. I was like, oh. But anyway, yeah, he, uh, coach, coach gave him a compliment. Uh, I don't know if it's another coach from another team gave him a compliment as well. First game, new club, jerseys will be coming in soon. So you guys saw that, saw that jersey, those are the old jerseys. He was wearing one of the kids that wasn't playing his jersey. Uh, so new jerseys probably in a couple of weeks. And uh, sounds like there's probably some travel as well. Mm -hmm. Trips to Cali maybe. So stay tuned, just the beginning. All right, so while we were gone at basketball, Sierra's off at work. She gets off in about an hour. And me, mom, papa just came over with their new puppy. They have a, they got a puppy. <laughs> me, mom's been wanting one for a while. You know, we've had baby now for ten years. Uh, Ace has been here for a little over a year. You know, the retired. She's been wanting a, she's been wanting a dog for a while. And so, uh, this last, last couple of days, they saw a litter of puppies and was absolutely. They just fell in love with it. So we haven't met him yet. I think his name is Buddy. Yeah, Buddy. Buddy or Bud. I don't know. He's he's here. And um, Tiffany's uncle and aunt, Ron and Sybil, are here from the Midwest. So they're, they're visiting, first time here, seeing the house. 
Uh, there's a community event going on with some live music and vendors and stuff, so they're over there right now. Bryce is gonna shower and then we're gonna meet up with them over there. I think she's just more excited to see you, Dad. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Look at here. Here's Buddy. You want to see Buddy? Yeah, it's Buddy. Yeah. Come here. <laughs> come here, girl. Oh, come on. You're not. You're not jealous now. <laughs> so actually, by the time Bryce got done showering, uh, the event, the event was over, and everybody had come back home. So that's why uh, there's no footage of the event because we missed it. All right. We got pulled pork. We got pulled pork. <laughs> We got bread, we got green beans, oh yeah, salad, two salads, and Tiffany's mac and cheese. We got the full spread. And later, homemade dessert. Good? Amazing. Amazing? salad, yeah. Not too shabby for you, old man, huh? It's like a... Got some crusty bread. Some bread. Where's the, where's the butter? Where's the butter? Where's the butter? <laughs> the old fart stable. I like apple pie too. I like my favorite steak. Apple, yeah. Like apple pie. Strudel? Toaster strudel? <laughs> Alright guys, so uh, fast forward a few hours later, me and my papa, everybody, Bebo's, everybody left, and I just realized I never actually vlogged the puppy. So you guys will have to go to the Bebo's vlog, it'll be here. You know where the Bebo's are at. The, Chrissy, Chrissy vlogged the, the puppy. Cute little guy, about the size of my hand, basically. Uh, which it's is baby. deceiving. Baby was never that small. No, she wasn't. Not when we had her. We had her three months, yeah. Yeah, we had her just three months. He's like six weeks old. Tiny little thing. Hopefully they, he stays tiny. That's what, that's what Mima wants, is a little, little dog. I don't yeah. think he's that tiny. It's a Jack Russell Terrier mix, so it's gotta be not that huge. We'll see, we'll not see. Not bigger than baby. Hey, Sierra's home from work, and we're in the kitchen hanging out. Tiffany is working on dinner. For tomorrow. For tomorrow. Yes, so this is what we're looking at recreating. It's fantastic. It's a London broil, right? Mm -hmm. Anyway, these are all the ingredients that she's whipped up here in this bowl. And we got two London broils I just smacked with a tenderizer. And so, it smells good. It's a lot of ingredients for Mary. Yep, those are the best ones. Well, there you go, guys. Bryce is back in the club on the court. Uh, like I said, unfortunately, I missed his one bucket. He put up a nice three, uh, but I left the other ones in so you guys could see that you know he is he's being aggressive. He's going for the ball. He's going for rebounds. Uh, he's making plays. You know, one of the one of the things he got complimented at the end of his school season was uh, his assists and his, his the ability to see the court. So I think you know he may not be as much of a shooter as he used to be, but he's definitely smart uh, on the court and you know looking for those lines and passes and. You know, not all his passes are perfect, but he's definitely looking down the court at, at, at you know, where his teammates are at and making plays. And he helps, he gets a lot of assists. That's, that was his number one stat uh, in the school season uh, this last year. So uh, only three practices with these kids. This is the first game, and this is a league, which means there'll be a, a game every Saturday for the next six weeks, I believe. Um, and then any tournaments that pop up between now and then as well, they'll play those. And those are where like, they play like two or three games uh, in one weekend. But for now, just one game a weekend. And uh, so lots more basketball to come and he practices two times a week. So he's you know, just building chemistry with these guys and the coach and, you know, um, getting acclimated. A couple kids from his school. So he knows those kids, but everyone else is pretty much first time he's ever played with them. So uh, not too bad for their first game. Up next, Sierra and I are heading to Philadelphia for a volleyball tournament. And uh, so I sh there, sh there should be, you know, a nice travel slash volleyball vlog. And I'll, to, I'll admit, guys, after editing this vlog and even going through footage from another vlog that I'm not posting because it's absolute garbage, in my mind, I feel like I'm getting, I'm slowly getting back, you know, the vlogging mojo. But after watching, you know, the last two weekends and the footage, I still have a long way to go. I just need to get back in the rhythm of picking up the camera and, and you know, turning it on. And, and also, not even just that, because I, I make, I do a good job of capturing moments. I don't fill in the gaps with this uh, in the moment, and I need to get back into the swing of that. It's weird. It, it feels awkward. It feels like I'm like I've never done this before, and I'm starting from scratch, and it feels awkward again. And I, I'm trying to shake that, I'm trying to shake that. So, just know that I'm thinking about you guys. Uh, you know, I see your guys' comments. I appreciate all the support and positivity, and and you know, sticking with us. Those of you who stick with us, are still here and sticking with us. I do appreciate it. The ones who watch every single vlog. Uh, big shout out to all the channel members that are still, uh, you know. Uh, 
paying sub members. I really appreciated that support as well and um, trying to do some more behind the scenes photos. I'll, I'll post, be posting some photos from the Philadelphia trip just for members on the community tab as well. I just need to get back in the, the YouTube groove. You know, I've been focused on Twitch so long and you know, Twitch is, is humming along and doing great. I need to kind of swing back over to YouTube and, and, uh, and you know, do a tune up over here. So anyway, uh, stay tuned for Philadelphia vlog coming up next and uh, thank you so much for watching. Vlog on.